Right then, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to The Binding of Isaac. I'm going to play more of The Keeper, and I don't know where I'm going to put some bonus footage, but, um, my game bugged, and I was able to retry my previous Lost Run. Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to put that at the beginning or the end, but let's, you rest assured that if you haven't seen it already, it's in here somewhere. <gasps> I got Teleport 2.0! Oh! Isn't that useful? The way that I would be able to, um, you know, leave behind my wooden nickel and then not have a supply of health. However, now that I know how that, that item works, it is very, very tempting to take that. Because I can get an I am error room every single floor. Well, <clears throat> I could have had an I am error room every single time, but, uh, didn't get to the secret room. Oh. Gives kisses, does he? <laughs> what do you say about that? <laughs> what a brilliant item for me to find. He, he gives kisses, ladies and gentlemen. He gives me hearts. I mean, I'm, I'm right in saying that hearts can't even drop. So if, the, if it will even drop anything. That little thigh was about to drop hearts, and instead it gave me bloody flies. Which is not a bad thing. But... It does tell you how this is gonna go, don't it? Ooh, a sacrificial knife. That's very tempting. However, you know what's more tempting? Seeing if I can just fuck this game right off and come back alive and have both of these. Uh. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. <laughs> oh well. do reroll reward Ooh, I like the sounds of this one a lot more than I like the sounds of anything else oh I'm gonna reroll you am I fuck it I like a challenge you just killed your spiders immediately is this room designed to pretty much just fuck this champion in the ass because it seems like it killed you oh I got lock up in some keys, and now... Huh? What? What the... I guess if you use it in the boss room, it just takes you to a random room on the floor and re-rolls that instead? Uh, Alright, cool. That's, now I know that that item is garbage. Fuck it, don't even care. If I'm correctly, you had one charge at one point. Can I have... The small rock, you see, if I say it, if I just cut myself in the middle, apparently, it'll give me what I wanted. And I got four chests for the price of three, and I benefited not even slightly. Well, Oh, I can jump. Don't do drugs, kids. Fuck. Really? Of, like, all the bills. It's that. Oh, my God. I, uh, why do you hate me? <gasps> Doesn't even matter about the health down. If anything, I would have been pissed off if I got that before the health down. I'm happy that I got it. Except if I would have had the devil deal, and then I could have bought that, and then I could have restocked my health. And, uh... Oh, God. Because if it weren't for that, I could have bought this with the safety and security, but I'm going to do it anyway, because fuck it. Don't even care. Again. I didn't make it this far by being sensible now, did I? I just pinned myself. I got stuck on the mushroom like a fucking idiot. Well, I, I guess it's safe to say there wasn't mushroom to move. <laughs> Keep going. You... You fucking what? Really, it does that? Okay. I died to a corny shit. For the love of God, I died to the personification of my comedy. Don't be held down. Brains down. Why you gotta do that to me? I'll take it. Thank you. Probably going to end up regretting that. If I was sensible, I just wouldn't take devil deals and I would just refuse them and then wait for angel rooms. That's obviously the smarter thing to do. But oh well, right? Oh my god, are you fucking... I'm not giving up. Suddenly realized that I just got Curse of the Blind. Look at my face. Look in a little bit more. I don't have eyes. Lil Loki. We've got a three-way and a four-way. This is a fucking orgy, isn't it? 
He, he might be low key, but when he gets it shoved up his ass, he'll be hitting the high key. Ha ha. Mom's coin purse. Luck up. Infested, bad, gas, and pretty fly. None of those were bad, and I am amazed. Cheers, game. <gasps> Damage in HP, you know. For a smart man, I would have held on to that right there just for a moment, then gone to see if I got a devil deal, then I could have taken it, come back and got that, and got my health back up. You see, the thing about me is, I can realize where these strategies align, what I should do. Problem is, I don't fucking stop long enough to actually bloody benefit from it. This is a good thing, by the way. This is a very good thing. This, this is essentially doubles my chances of getting things. Suddenly realized, if I could get Hood of the Martyr, I'm, I would be close to Invincible. I wouldn't be Invincible, I'd be close to Invincible. Is this a secret room? Fuck me. Magic Mushroom. I did get that, so I can't complain. Please be tears up. Or speed up. You know what? Anything that's up, I'll take. Including the Pixar movie. Oh. Now the smart thing to do is to not spend your bloody coin charges out there. You spend it in here so you've got health to pick up. See? Fucking hell, I'm stupid. I really need to actually get into my head how to play these characters. My problem is I've played Isaac for that long that I've forgotten that there's supposed to be strategies to go alongside all the other characters. This one is basically get the nickel, get a charge, spend it in the fucking room of the boss that you're going to be fighting for a while, not fucking out. Gosh darn it! Cheers, babe. Suddenly realized I could have just... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Can we just slow-mo replay the part where I just threw away more coins by picking them up and not using the fucking machine first? <laughs> so... I accidentally used the sharp plug thing, and, uh... This is essentially a way to potentially duplicate your money. I mean, again, this mainly works because I have the old double charge and sharp plug. It wouldn't really work all too efficiently otherwise. You'd, you'd need the double charge. Perfectly honest. See, I was kind of waiting for one of those to spawn to prove that you could use it to duplicate your money, but it was taking too long, so I gave up, and then that happened anyway, so. You get the idea. You can get dimes and nickels from doing that. It's very unlikely, but you can. Oh. 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 <laughs> Did I just get that? When I get hit, I drop money. Really? Holy lord. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna win. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm gonna have a victory here, and you can bank on that. Fucking hell. And I just didn't drop money, so actually... I guess not, never mind. I finally realized, but the, if, if you get to Ultra Greed, and then you fight him with the Keeper, you end up with infinite health if you've saved your money. Because every time he hits you, you're gonna drop your currency. Huh. Oh yes. This is another reason why I love this trinket. Look at my tears, look at my fire rate, look at my everything. I'm just sad that's not permanent. <laughs> like, as soon as you leave that room, it's just like, oh, oh my happiness. You know, those, those black-boned fellows with the explosives, gotta find it weird how they've managed to get to that state. Because usually, you know, you get calcium to make your bones stronger. I guess they have vitamin C4. Oh, a quick charge. Glorious. Ended up getting a fair amount of my money back for that one. Love you! I've suddenly realized with quicker charge, as long as I survive, I can keep generating money. Infinite health build inbound. Assuming you're good and not shit. And I am quite shit. So, don't worry. I can and will fuck this up. <coughs> what the f- what?! <coughs> there was one little fucking stupid cancerous cunty bollocks still alive. Remember like two seconds ago when I said don't worry with my infinite health build, I'll still fuck it up. Still fucked it up. And with that, the better portion of the content has come to a close. If you did indeed enjoy it, please do like the video now, and I shall make more of it, despite the fact it's driving me up the fucking wall playing these two characters, the Lost and the Keeper. Oh, two days straight. Oh my lord, that killed me on the inside. 
And again, as I said, as the better portion of this is over, you may want to check out somebody else listed here. For instance, Tomato Gaming, Fruitman, the best fucking content creator on this goddamn site that nobody seems to be bloody aware of. At least in the grand scheme of things. He's honestly my personal favourite content creator, barring John Tron, but he, he, in terms of frequency, the damn tall fruit man wins. So, uh, honestly, please go check him out. For me, at least. I, I, I like to think if I like him, then you will too. We, we share similar tastes, roughly. That is why you like me, correct? And speaking of liking me, you can go ahead and follow me on Twitter so you can like my tweets. I hate myself. Mm, don't worry. The feeling's mutual. I hated that just as much as you did. We can do it to keep up today with videos, get some bad jokes, and see me bitching mono complain. Anyway, that being said and out of the way, we shall now return to our regularly scheduled programming. Um... I just loaded my game up a day after the lost run, and apparently because I had the missing poster, the game fucking broke, and despite the fact I did lose and I was on that death screen permanently for like a good five minutes monologuing, this is still here and I'm able to do this again. I didn't even mean to break it, but somehow I did. I'm gonna give this another shot. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? What? I didn't even have the missing poster anymore, it was... What? I'll try again. I don't mind. This is just fucking AIDS. That is just fucking AIDS. Spider-Man. Spider-Man? What are you doing, man? <laughs> oh my god, this TNT bat roll is boring. That's just, that's just syllable jokes. It's not even a joke, that's just syllable matching. It's supposed to be funny. Mm, fuck, you didn't call yourself a comedian? No, I'm not Jeffrey Dean Morgan. Aha, uh -huh, get it? Because that's the actor that played the comedian in, 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 in Watchmen. It's a fucking amazing movie. If you haven't watched it, you're missing out. Oh. One spawn flies, the other spawn flies. Both did die, and I'm wondering why. I even got out of bed this morning. I recorded Super Mario 64 and this in one day. My day has been nothing but pain thus far. Now I'm just waiting to lift some weights, drop it on my foot, break the damn thing, and then be in agony for the next week. That'll be the trifecta of pain for today. You know, I'm honestly surprised Edmund didn't come up with a character that had a permanent curse. Like, literally, this does feel like he should have Curse of the Blind. Uh, sorry, I didn't know your voice was Brink, because quite clearly that is broken. Not a coin for me. Yes, yeah, some bats. I didn't have any. You're, you're a nice guy, you know, eh? You, you get too much flack. Keeper? You are a keeper. You're a lovely man. You're the kind of guy I'll yeah, Gail, because I don't know, your gender's ambiguous, that I'd like to take home to my parents. Only, you are a small child. You, you, you are also a fested corpse of a small child. The only place I'd be taking you home is my basement, so nobody would ever see you me in, and me enjoying you. And that's probably the worst thing I've ever said out loud on the show. You sure said it, mommy. I just said mummy. <laughs> Brandon Frazier, in the mummy, coming soon, five star. Oh, come on my tits, yeah, yeah, come on my tits, it's a building. What the fuck am I saying? <laughs> it's a building. <laughs> I know I'm just saying gibberish to myself to pass the time in between fucking uninteresting things, but bloody hell. It's a building. <laughs> what? 
Oh, God.